Welcome to Linux tutorial. In this video, I am going to show you how to install Group Office on Ubuntu. Group Office is an open source group pair and CRM application which allows you to share the documents and files and the projects to the clients over the web browser. So we can install Group Office on a centralized server and then the clients can be able to access the server and then create documents and share projects so let me show you how to install this on ubuntu group office will require for lamp server so we need to set up lamp server before installing group office now you can run the following command to set up the lamp server now type this command this command will install the package for lamp server and then php extension the lamp is nothing but we need to install the package for Apache Web Server and then MySQL Web Server and PHP. Now hit enter. Now the packages are installing. Wait for some time. While installing the package, it will ask you to set the root password for MySQL. Now here, type your password. and then wait for some time until the packages are unpacked now the installation is completed next enable php encrypt module now type this command to enable the php encrypt module next we need to download group of this package so now move to your document root cd space slash var slash www slash html and then from here run the following command to download the package now type this command and then hit enter now the package is downloading wait until it's complete here you can see it is a tar file it is in the format tar.cz so after downloading we need to accept the package using tar command now the download is complete now you can see the tar file in your document root we can remove the syntax file we don't need this this one is the default index page for apache now we can accept the package using tar command now type tar space hyphen xz vf space package name and then hit enter now it's extracting after extracting you can see a new directory is created under the document root this name is too lengthy let's make it short so let's rename the directory type the command me space and then rename it to group office you can rename it to any name you want now the directory is renamed now let's make this directory will be writable for apache user and apache group for that we need to change the ownership to the respected apache user and apache group so run the command ch1 space hyphen capital r space here in ubuntu the apache user is www hyphen data so type it www hyphen data this one is for user and put colon and then the group user also has the same name www hyphen data space the territory name group office now hit enter now let's create the database and database user for group office so log into the mysql database type the command mysql space hyphen u space root space hyphen p Now from here, run the following command 
to create database and database user. If you want any help in MySQL database, you can type the command help space grant. Here you can see the command to create user. Now run the command to create the database. Now type this command and then hit enter. Now the database is created. Now let's create the user. Just copy and paste the command and then change the name. Here I'm going to create the user in the name of group office underscore user. And then I will set the password as 123. Now you can change it like this according to your needs. And then hit enter. Now the user is created. Let's set the permission for the user to the database. Copy and paste this command. And then change the name. This one is database name and here put your database username and then hit enter now press the privileges now we can exit Next, we need to create virtual host for group office. For that, we need to create new configuration field for Apache. Now run the following command. Now type this command to create the new configuration field for Apache for creating the virtual host. Now type this command. Let's create the soft link for this configuration field into this size enable directory. Now open the file. Now here, create the entry as follows. Now type like this and then save the file. Restart the Apache service. Now all things is set. Now group office is ready for installation. Next we need to open the browser. Now open the browser. And then here enter the link as follows. Now type like this. Here you must replace with the IP address or host name. And then the TLT name which is located under your document root. Now click continue. We need to run this command. And then we need to run this command to create directory. And then we need to change the ownership for the directory. Now click continue. Here fill the information and then click continue. 
now click continue here we need to type the database name and database username and then password now type it and click continue now here create the admin account now type it and click continue after installation complete we need to run this command to change the file permission now you can click here here you can see the login page type your username and password and you click ok now you can see now here logged in here we can able to create the document and the project so that's all about the installation of group office hope this video is helpful for you thank you for watching